Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, I'm Rachel of all things Pins and Disney and today we have another Bippity Box unboxing. My Bippity Box has arrived and I am excited because we have the holiday packaging. Comment down below if you're digging this new holiday packaging because I am. I had wish lists quite a few items. I feel like one of them at least made the cut but I'm curious to see if I got multiple items on my wish list in this box because that was the case during my first Bippity Box unboxing which if you have not checked that out yet, I will link it down below and also up in the cards for you to see. But without further ado, let's get into this. I'm gonna open the box. Oh, you guys, we have the happy or home for the holidays. This is the spoilers card which I will open at the end but this is so cute. I should have wore my Christmas wreath ears. I feel like that those ears would have been perfect for this video. But we have the green holiday tissue packaging with the Christmas holiday bippity sticker. And let's get into this box. We have a bunch of frugals and I already see one item that I put on my wish list. But the first item I see here is something I didn't put on, but it's kind of cool. And I, I've i seen this in other people's Bippity boxes before, so I know that it's a bar of soap. But it is a Disney Parks and Resort exclusive because they have the sticker on here. But if you like hold this up to the light, this bar of soap actually looks really cool. That's the first item. I'm kind of excited to show you what I saw, which I had wish lists. You guys, it is, no shock there, another pair of ears and I'm happy I got this. Again, it is a Disney Park exclusive item, which they also have put the sticker there. Let me try these, let me try these out. And I always try to like do it with the tag hiding in the back. But, gosh. Oh, wow. Sorry. I kind of like freaked out there. But these are great ears for New Year's. I don't know about you. But I mean, they're also good for the holidays. But wow. Look how pretty these ears. You know, like my ear collection is slowly growing. It's still small like it's not as significant as some others i've seen but it's slowly but surely it's growing i'm excited to have to add this one into my ear collection because you guys how beautiful is this one and also these ears are all they're also comfortable i'm not sure if i'm like starting to you know be okay with park ears. I know like I complained once about one of the ears. They were a little bit uncomfortable, but lately a lot of the ears that I've, I've been getting from the Disney parks, they have been super comfortable. Granted though, I am not wearing them for hours at the parks. I'm only wearing them for a short amount of time. So really I have to put them to the test. All right, so the next item I kind of saw peeking through, but I got, I actually requested this in my wish list as well. This is also a Disney Park exclusive, but these were, I don't know if they're um, available in the shops, but if they are, comment down below if you know. Um, and again, I don't know if these were, I feel like these were released on Shop Disney, but they sold out and they never brought it back. But it comes with a pin and it has a patch. Honestly, I wanted this more so for the patch. I saw somewhere on Instagram where someone, she put this patch on like a cosmetic case and it looked so chic, so amazing. And I love that it's iridescent, like the gold part here. Oh my God, I'm, I'm totally stoked about this. I don't care so much for the pin, I'm gonna admit. Um, so I might even trade this away but i'm just really excited for the patch let's see if there's an oh there is another item and i think that's the last thing <laughs> okay this was also another item i put on my wish list 
This is the new uh, Remy pin from their Ratatouille Adventure collection. I actually, now this was on Shop Disney, I don't think it's on there anymore. When I went on Shop Disney when these pins were released, I was I could have gotten the whole set, but I actually got one of the other pins from this collection, which I'll link a photo or put a photo here. After getting that pin and after getting in the mail, I kind of wish I got this one. Hence why I ended up um, putting this on my wish list because to be honest, now I have both pins. I do think this one is cuter. The uh, salt pepper or the salt shaker here has a little like pop out 3D element, but oh my gosh, I definitely I prefer this pin over the other one, and I'm happy I can add this to my collection. I actually collect a lot of attraction pins. Normally, I try to collect the pins after I have r rode the ride, but I couldn't pass this up when I saw that the Biddy Box had this on their like wish list page. So I'm glad they included this in my box. I just double checked the box to make sure there was nothing else in there so we can finally move on to the spoiler sheet. So the Disney Parks exclusive Minnie Mouse champagne ears. They retail for $29.99 and I always do this, but let me give a shout out to Brenda, Mama B, who curated my box. She did amazing. Brenda, she curated my first Bippity box and I was so happy with that one and she nailed it out of the park again with this one. So great job, Brenda, if you're watching this. You did an amazing job curating my box. So this was $29.99. The Disney Parks exclusive 50th anniversary Mickey patch and pin set, the world's most magical celebration, retails for $19.99. The Disney Parks exclusive rock candy rainbow basin soap retails for $5.99. And last but not least, the Disney Parks exclusive Remy's Ratatouille Adventure pin retails for $12.99, which brings the total of the box to a total value of $68. 96. So this fantasy box does retail for $59.99 and I got over the value of what I paid for for this box and I'm absolutely happy with everything I got in this month's Bippity box. I am excited. I look forward to the next one and I can't wait to unbox next month with you guys but so far I, I'm just kind of blown away with this month's box. Comment down below what was your favorite item. Let me know if you are subscribed to Bippity Box. And please give this video a thumbs up. Really helps out with the channel. And please subscribe for more Bippity Box unboxing or just any Disney content in general. And I'll see you guys soon in the next one. Bye guys.